the Arab world's greatest taboos, homosexuality. It's against our religion. It's not acceptable at all to be a homosexual. Pervez Sharma spent five and a half years documenting the lives of gay and lesbian Muslims. Right now, there's a battle for the soul of Islam. I was a marked man, a Muslim who was not only openly gay, but had also been publicly labeled an infidel. Do you take Daniel to be your lawful neighbor and husband? Yes, sir. I expect to see the bloody sheet in the morning. <laughs> My mother never forgave me for being gay. I am now faced with a crisis of faith. I need to prove that I can be a good Muslim and be gay. Three days I leave for Saudi Arabia. The beheading of an Indonesian maid in Saudi Arabia. I'm going there to complete my Hajj pilgrimage, just like millions of Muslims before me have. Saudi Arabia is one of the most repressive countries in the world. The only difference with my Hajj is that I'm going there as an openly gay man, an act that is punishable by death. Reading this for a rather long time. Let's go, hope we come out alive. Brothers and sisters, it is not a minor moment, it is an extremely significant moment. The Saudis have cordoned off every area that might be too dangerous to film. For Muslims like me, Islam has been a faith of fear. Do I belong in this religion that condemns me? No, 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 no! Oh my God! 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 O